face putting all our alpha cars down on the table knowing there's no way that you'll be able to win this one but she's somebody else in the making first she's just gotta stop all the faking and she'll be But she's wondering if it's gonna feel like she's forever Wondering if it's gonna feel like she's whenever She leaves her safe space She leaves her safe space Wondering if it is forever Or is there some place that will make Hello sweet friends! I hope you all are doing so good. I know I have been MIA for about three weeks and to everyone that um, sort of asked or wondered where I was, I have been very busy um, just dealing with family business stuff. Um, that has needed to, um, I needed to give that my attention. <laughs> um, it's still a work in progress, um, just with the taxes and all the craziness that I'm sort of having to uh, deal with right now. But I'm very excited to get today's video out to you. Um, but if you are new here, hi, hello, and welcome. My name is Olivia, and on my channel, I create all sorts of feel-good content, just plan out good for the soul. So if that interests you, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button and join my YouTube family. Um, and today is actually a very different video for me. I have never done a vlog or uploaded a vlog on my channel before. I have attempted many vlogs day in the lives before, um, but hopefully <laughs> if you were seeing this, I have successfully edited and uploaded a vlog. Um, and I'm very excited because it is my 21st birthday. I am doing this outro a days later from my actual birthday. Um, but I think you guys are really going to enjoy today's video as I take you along with me just with the process of getting ready. Um, I experienced a college bar for the first time. I made my own 21st uh, tiara or headband um, and just did a little bit of shopping here and there. Um, so I'm just really excited to take you along and just show you as much as I could. Um, but anyways, without further ado, let's get started on my 21st birthday vlog. Good morning, friends. Um, it is today is my birthday. <laughs> so I'm just taking it really easy today. Um, it is almost, what time is it? It is 11.17. So <laughs> there's Mr. Kitten. <laughs> oh. But today, I'm just going to have a lot of fun taking you guys with me as I um, I need to get some new foundation, um, new lip gloss for this Friday. Um, so I'll probably go to Ulta. I'm going to take you guys along with me to going to Goodwill um, <laughs> to just see what they have. And just like Goodwill is my favorite place on earth. So of course, I have to do that on my birthday. Um, and then I think we'll go to um, Sally Hansen to get some of like this dip powder. It's like this new way to paint your nails. It's like you paint on a clear coat, you dip your nail into this powder of whatever color you choose, paint on the clear coat, and it's supposed to like just look super, super nice. Mm. Yes, so Goodwill. Makeup at Ulta, nail stuff at Sally Hansen. So anyways, yes, without further ado, let's get started on today's video. Okay. 
Okay, you guys, so I got done with a Goodwill, Ulta, and Sally Hansen. Um, so I'm gonna do a quick little haul. So at Goodwill, I just found um, some books that I will use for stacking. And then I found I've literally been needing a nude slip for under some of like my white dresses um, or for under dresses that are just a little bit more see-through. So I found one in my size and it's like super nice and yep, really nice. <laughs> and it's like not gross, it's like new. And then I also found these cute little shoes that are in size six and a half, which is my perfect size. And they're perfect. They've been used a little bit, but they are so, so stinking cute. And I cannot wait until it is warm enough outside. And then at Ulta, it worked out because I was starting to like get things. I'm like, man, this is going to be so expensive. Um, and then I ended up having an $8 off. So if you guys like want like a flawless finish um, with your powder, um, the NYX HD Studio, it is like the most magical translucent powder that I have ever used, but you have to be careful with it um, because if you pack too much on, um, it has really bad like photo flash. I got this uh, Revolution. Uh, lip gloss. I can't really tell, but it's a very pretty shade. So I'm excited. Well, let's try it out. So I'm going to try it out. Um, they have this like more peachy, orangey tone, and I'm like, I like am drawn to that type of lip gloss or um, lipstick shade. But I'm like, no, let's just try and go with something that's a little bit more pinky like my existing lip gloss off and my like lips are naturally pink right now because they're sort of chapped right now um oh shoot uh anyways it's 52 degrees outside and I'm just now thinking I'm like I knock on wood I really hope I don't get sick because we're gonna go from 52 degrees to negative four <laughs> in the span of a few days so let's see Not my favorite. This was $7, so maybe that explains it. It looks really pretty in the package, but it's just like the way it, I don't know. We'll see. But at Sally Hansen, the girl was so nice um, trying to help me um, pick a, like th those dip powders and sort of explaining it to me. And she said, and I started to add it up, like if I was to buy it individually, like all the different things I needed and I sort of saved some money with getting the uh, the dip powder kit. So this was $40, which is a little expensive. Um, but then I just got like a little filer cube and then I got a white or no, a clear, um, a clear color. Cause this comes with two different colors. You guys can see that pink and then that tannish color. So I'm excited to test it out tonight. And then I've been wanting to do some nail art. Um, and I'll take you guys along with me while I try this out in a temp nail art that's really popular on Instagram right now. Um, but I just got a little nail brush, so hopefully it all works out. Um, but it is 218 and it's 52 degrees. I need to go through the car wash and I need, I need to head back home and I need to take Butters on a walk. So that is the plan for now. So yes, that was very successful. So I just got done with a really nice walk um, with Marcus and Butters because it is about pretty much, it's like 60 degrees out. It is so nice. Um, we are not going to see this type of weather for a really long time, but I basically failed to go to the store while I was out, so I really need to go, um, or else I just feel like by tomorrow, midday, 
Um, that's when the storm's really going to hit. Um, I just feel like everything is going to be gone because yesterday, like, everything was gone. Um, so I'm just going to run to Kroger real quick and then get ready for dinner. Hi. Yes. Yes. Oh my goodness. Hi. Yes. Alrighty, you guys, I just got home from the grocery store. It was a little crazy, but it wasn't as bad as yesterday. Um, but I wanted to show you guys what Marcus surprised me with. A bouquet of flowers. And a birthday card, of course. Then he also got me this super cute plant in this beautiful um, little pot. So I'm going to figure out a home for him. city to find a sash or a tiara I don't I don't really want to wear a sash because my dress is so simple and I it's so simplistically beautiful you guys will see I don't know if it's going to be in the thumbnail but you'll see here later on in the video but I but my main focal point of my whole 21st birthday outfit are these shoes these are the ink brand and I found these online super cheap on sale at Macy's and unfortunately they are discontinued um, I got so many compliments on them I try to look at look them up for some friends and I'm just like hey sorry they're discontinued but there are a much nicer nicer version um, a little bit more high-end, a little bit more expensive of the same style of shoe. And they are the Betsy Johnson. Um, she has some stunning gemmed out shoes on the Macy's website. Um, definitely go check, check it out if you love this style of shoe. But I thought that the bow was absolutely stunning. Uh, and I have silver, like, I have like matching earrings um but anyways i'm like okay i don't really want to distract the dress with a sash um so i figured i would make a headband just because i don't have a lot going up like with the dress and i don't really have any loud jewelry um and nothing with my hair so um i ran the hobby i ran to hobby lobby and i probably spent way too much money on this um but i think it's going to turn out so cute so we got a simple headband everything that i got um is some of it is from the his and hers selection his and hers uh collection so the wedding collection at Hobby Lobby. They were half off today. So I tried to get as much as I could from that line. Um, and then I got some things from the paper studio. Um, so these are just some like extra fun little things. These are some silver hearts to match. These are just, I may not use them, but they're really pretty. Um, so where did the two go? Hold on. Okay, so here's the plan. Um, so instead of like having like a tiara tiara with like a little thing on it saying 21st birthday, I wanted to make my own 21st birthday headband. So the two and the one, these two little numbers are from the wood section, but from the paper studio, I found some uh, adhesive gems and pearls which are so fun and of course they match the shoes it's perfect it completes the outfit okay i need to get started on this and i will let you guys know how it goes
you guys I'm not I'm wearing I'm wearing a sports bra <laughs> looks like I was naked for a second um but to update you guys it is Friday the next Friday February 11th um I've had an absolutely crazy week and right now I need to finish up some things before it's 10 30 right now in the morning um I really hope I can get this done by the latest one this afternoon um but to update you guys like why I'm wanting to get my work done before one is because this Friday night, I am going to meet my bestest friend. We are going to go to this college bar. I've never experienced this before, and I'm very excited to see her and celebrate with her because she turned 21 this last September, and of course, I could not go because <laughs> I wasn't 21 yet. Um, so that is what I'm doing tonight. I'm very excited, but to update you guys, I left you on a cliffhanger last Friday, so it's exactly one week later. It seems like eternity. I'm very excited to blow off some steam tonight. Now, you should not blow off stress by drinking. I do not condone that. But I'm just very excited to just like have fun, go dancing, sing a little bit. We'll see. We'll, I, I don't know what the atmosphere is going to be like, um, but hopefully I can do some of that because I've had a very long week. Um, I won't get too much into that. I'm just glad it's Friday. I'm glad the project that I have been working on all week is almost done. Um, but last Friday, I had the most perfect 21st birthday party. Um, it, the evening was just so amazing. That's sort of why I didn't film because I was just purely enjoying the moment. Um, and I, I wanted to film me getting ready, but I honestly was sort of in a rush towards the end of it. So hopefully today I can take you along with me as I just pamper myself and I'll maybe show you what I'll do for my makeup and I need to redo my nails because they're a little nasty. I'm wanting to do like a clear polish with either some white or red hearts. I feel like that that would be so, so cute for Valentine's Day. I feel like I've been seeing a lot of people do that lately. Um, so I'll attempt I want to go to Target and find some heart stickers. I feel like they have like nail art stickers at Target. So oh. Butters, she's got a little dryer bowl. Put in, I can't really zoom in. Butters, oh my goodness. If that's not the cutest thing you've ever seen, I don't know what is. Oh my goodness. Um, but anyways, yes, I'm just really excited to get pampered. I'm really excited to see Jill. I'm at Target. Um, I'm gonna be doing a few quick little errands. It's 1.30 right now, oh my goodness. So I need to find some sparkly black tights. I need to look at their nail art section um, and just see what they have because I really like that um, like clear or like light pink colored base nail and then they have like white or red little mini hearts um, and of course Target is crazy busy. <laughs> I, I, I think it's been like since Christmas time the last time I came here. Where are you going first? Job. <laughs> Anyways, this Jeep, it's a two-door Jeep. It's so easy to parallel park and all of that. Anyway, so yes, I'm gonna go in here, find, look at their tight section, look at their nail section, get some snacks um, for tonight and just for the road and all that stuff, maybe for tomorrow as well. Um, so yeah.
story short, no sparkly tights, no heart shaped stickers. They only had like stars and like they had like food. I really thought the little strawberry ones were cute, but it's like they had strawberry, banana, like kiwi. I'm just like, I just want the strawberry stickers, but I didn't get those because I didn't want to spend $8 and just get the strawberry nail stickers <laughs> from this pa from this $8 package and not use any of the others. Um, but I thought that those were really fun. I'm like, okay, I know that they're there. I know that they're selling this brand. I don't remember what it was, but if you want to get like little nail sticker art things and lots of different like press on nails. Um, anyways, <laughs> I'm going to let you guys go um, as I head home and I'll, I'll update you guys when I start getting ready. You thought he needed them, but he's not coming back again. So he's gone, leaving then. You won't see him again. It was convenient, but you won't be staying friends. Okay, you guys. So I absolutely love these 99 cent bags from TJ Maxx. This one, of course, is so cute with the bumblebees, but I love these because I can fit all my toiletries, all my shoes, all my um, like traveling essentials like pillows, blankets, um, snacks and all that good stuff. And I'm staying at Jill's for tonight at her apartment. Um, I'm just gonna pack some of my things so I don't have to like, so she doesn't have to like, you know, let me use one of her blankets or her towels or you know, her clothes. Like I'm just not gonna be that friend. Um, so anyways, we're taking some towels and definitely a face wash because I plan on being coherent enough this evening, later on tonight, to be able to take off my makeup. So um, I'm definitely going to bring all of my skincare essentials and then I always pack a blanket and I always bring my dad's blanket. So for good measure, I am taking this um, just to comfort me and get me through the night. Because I'm probably gonna have to sleep on the couch, either in her bedroom floor or on the couch. So I need something to comfort me while I'm away in a new place. Um, and then I'm taking some semi-healthy snacks. We've got some fig bars and these go-go squeeze applesauces. I love these. So I'm probably gonna be pretty hungry on the drive up there. Again, it's only an hour an hour away, but there, I don't stop by any gas stations like the first part of the trip. It's all through cornfields. So wish me luck. <laughs> and then, um, ooh. So I am taking a sports bra, like a really, you can see like, this is a really like flimsy sports bra, but I'm packing that with my PJs for tonight because she has roommates and I don't want to be that one person because I have been around people where they just, we're all girls here, like, you know, we're all mature about it, but it's like, I don't know. I don't know if I want to be that person tonight with a white shirt and no bra, so... <laughs> and then some socks and girly stuff. And then for tomorrow on the ride home, we may go get breakfast together. Probably not. Um, she probably has to study. Um, but I just have some leggings, this new super cute little sports bra. Absolutely love it. And then some some undies and socks. <laughs> and then um, I found this seaside sweatshirt at Goodwill in teal and I'm like I know that this sweatshirt was like probably $50 for whoever bought it brand new but I just got it it's a little youth like a little bit worn <laughs> um worn and torn but I'm like I got this for four dollars so yes and some tennis shoes so now that our bag is halfway packed I'm so excited because I'm going to do a fashion show for you guys of some of the outfits 
some contenders that I may wear for tonight. And I'm gonna pick my favorite one and I'm gonna like wear it to her house. Um, but I'm gonna take some of the others, like a pair of jeans and maybe a top or two, just in case like somehow I'm like way more dressed up. So anyways, yes, let's pick it out. basically took me shopping at dry goods um for my 21st birthday like birthday um present um because she couldn't figure out what to get me and this is seriously like the best present ever and we just picked i think i probably tried on like 30 i'm not joking you like 30 different things <laughs> in the dressing room it was so much fun i'm just like like go mom like i know you'll probably watch this I don't know <laughs> but my mom is so hip like she like she picked out like the cool like the prettiest and the coolest things that I would have like totally overlooked she like mixed and matched things she's like oh try this on with this and I'm like how did she come up with this <laughs> and so yeah, so a lot of the outfits are kudos to my mom. And this this top is one of the things that she picked out and it was on sale. Everything is better when it's on sale. So, I don't know, it's cute. And then I have my little cheap little shoes. These are very comfortable. Um, <sighs> contender, contender number one. And so this is the outfit that my mom completely picked out all by herself. And this is like the outfit that when we were like, okay, uh, like when we were picking items, I'm like, okay, this is what I want to get. Um, we were like, oh, maybe this is the outfit I'm going to wear whenever I go out, you know, um, and celebrate with Jill just cause it's very like hip and collegey and I think I'm gonna take off my, uh, I'm not even gonna break. Well, should I bring it? I don't know. It's like, what if I get taken? This could track me. <laughs> okay, I won't wear it for now, but I may bring that tonight. My Apple Watch. Okay, which boot do I wear? That's the thing. Which one? try this outfit on with this leather skirt because I'm just like this is so flowy I'm just I mean I would wear Spanx under it but I'm just like I feel like this skirt is so like silky and pretty I just feel like it doesn't really go with the whole like like I feel like this is what I would wear to like a galaxy or like space party <laughs> pretty that is. Hmm. And for more of like a girly outfit, um, I just, this like, this silk dress, like, ah, it was $20 at TJ Maxx and I was looking at it, I'm like, you know, it looks really good on the hanger. And then it's just like one of those things that you like, try on it just hugs hugs me in all the wrong spots i don't know but anyways i figured hey it might be cute with this really pretty sweater that my mom picked out so between 
Okay, I'm going to decide between this outfit, this outfit, or my little galaxy outfit. Okay, but now it is, what time is it? It is 4.30, so I need to start getting ready, and yeah. She's Alrighty guys, as I am finishing up getting ready, this video is going to be coming to a close and stay tuned for the end because I have two little clips um, and then lots of photos just from the past two Fridays that I've had. Um, the first Friday, both Fridays were amazing. Um, I had such a wonderful time, um, such a fun time with my best friend at her college. Um, but I had such a wonderful time the first Friday where I had sort of my big birthday party. Um, I tried to just explain all the different little details to my mom that next Saturday or that following Saturday. Um, but I just told her, I'm like, you know what? I feel like I can never say enough to explain how truly amazing it was and just how special I felt um, and I just want to thank you guys so much for all the love and support you guys have given me over the past few months on my YouTube as I just continue to grow um, so if you haven't already I would love for you to hit that subscribe button I'm almost to 4,000 subscribers which is absolutely insane um, I just have so many goals for myself this year, um, so I'm just really excited that you guys get to come along with me in this new chapter of my adulthood. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys on my next video. Bye! Talking to myself like someone's gonna respond I'm getting tired of myself cause I don't know